Hey guys, Blake here with another video and today we've got another fish store tour. This time we're heading over to Lifestyle Aquarium in Bandura, which has a really great selection. So let's jump straight into the video. Okay guys, so to get started, Lifestyle Aquarium is located in Bandura, Victoria, which is in a northern suburb of Melbourne. Uh, you can see here the outside of the building, which is, you know, quite inviting. It's on a pretty busy road, but there is a car park located nearby. Uh, when you get in, you're greeted by this massive Oscar. As you can see, it's, you know, bigger than the size of my hand. And then I just give you a bit of a pan around the store, show you what's in, in uh, store. So, there are a number of aisles, you know, five or six. Occasionally, there's an aquamate in one of them. But uh, there's a good combination. I'd say about 50-50 salt water and fresh water. So we're getting started here. We've got a few displays to get started. We've got a salt water tank and a green tree frog tank. There are some others, but it was hard to see them at the time. Uh, we've got some salt water critters here. We have some uh, anemones. We've got some coral beauty angelfish. Some seahorses as well. And more coral than the eye can see. Uh, it would just take forever if I slowly panned through all this. So I'm sort of racing through and uh, you can still see that there's an absolute ton of uh, coral to choose from. So um, if you are looking for a few select pieces for your aquarium, maybe they have them in stock here. Uh, plenty of torches, uh, scullies, gonies, all the sorts of uh, things that you're looking for. So uh, bubbles as well and uh, hammers too so um, then you got some of the more SPS sort of related uh, coral there as well some Dallas and things like that now we move over to the freshwater we got some African cichlids of course we've got a bristle nose hanging out we've got some Buenos Aires tetras this was kind of cool there's uh, side drop filters and the filters have male bedders in them so I like that they're not in little jars and things like that uh, all the tetras and uh, some Mario River rainbow fish here. Uh, Siamese algae eaters, I think, are there. Another better in with that tank there. Episo cacatoides as well. So they do have some semi unique things as well. It's not just, uh, you know, your, your classic neon tetras. Three pretty awesome types of angelfish here. I like that uh, there's a bit of variety there as well. That's pretty cool. Got some activity here with some barbs. That's always fun to see. Uh, some more barbs here, different sort of barb there, I think. There's some Bolivian rams, neon blue acaras as well. So more a uh, bit of a beefier sort of cichlid. Albino crobensis there as well, which is pretty cool to see. Uh, Calico bristlenose just scooting off, and then they've got a huge number of uh, planted tanks here for for purchase. You can buy bunch plants and things like that. They all look nice and healthy, and uh, once again. Pretty nice variety there to choose from, so I'm sure there'll be uh, something in stock that will take your fancy. So just moving through here, having a look at the selection, and uh, there's certainly plenty of things, you know, mosses, val, crips, uh, anubias, and all that stuff. Got some garamis here, a bit of a mixed garami display tank, and uh, this little fish came up to say good day. Some coolie loaches, uh, know that they're a polarizing fish. We got some guppies and things hanging around here, some black neon tetras, cardinals and neon tetras as well. We got some mollies, guppies and platies, all your favourite live bearers. We got some display tanks happening as well, this is outside. We got some lizards of some sort, I think they might be bearded dragons. We got some turtles as well, short neck Murray River turtles. And we've got a coral display tank here, which looks pretty bare. I guess they're uh, low on stock at the moment, but that's good for business. We've got a bunch of dry stock here, a bunch of uh, tanks for sale and stuff, whether you're into all-in-one or uh, not all-in-one. Got a display uh, display reef here as well, heaps of torch in there. Uh, all the products you'll need as well, plenty of good aquascaping materials here. And the Aquaforest line of uh, supplements and things. Got some heaters, sand, gravel, ornaments, everything that you could really ask for in a aquarium store. So they really do a great job of maximizing the space at this particular store and uh, they keep it pretty fresh as well. You notice little pockets of salt water here, pockets of uh, fresh water here and then you come up on beautiful display tanks like this one here. 
So you got plenty of uh, options in terms of uh, tissue culture as well and uh, pretty much, yeah, you, you can't go wrong. So this is a cold water display tank here. So you got all your sort of uh, goldfish, axolotls, got some paradise fish here as well, I think somewhere. Uh, there they are. And yeah, mostly anything you could think of. So we're getting back to the monitor there. I'm not exactly sure what lizard that is, but pretty cool looking nonetheless. And then we've got some eel tail catfish and things like that in this display tank. So behind the counter you've got some more chemicals and then you've got the uh, frozen fruit freezer as well. So really like this store, uh, they tend to have really low priced uh, nano tanks so this is where I generally pick up my smaller tanks and stuff like that. I did end up picking up a nest of three cube tanks from this store and we had a lot of fun uh, walking around with Aquamate. So, Hopefully you enjoyed this tour. I'd say that the store is definitely worth checking out. Uh, there's, you know, a nice little variety there and some, you know, things that you don't see everywhere else. So definitely worthwhile checking out. The staff are really nice and they seem to do a good job of keeping everything healthy and tidy. So uh, definitely a great store in my books. Hopefully you liked this video. If you did, please like, subscribe and all that fun stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.